Hello all. Now that I've successfully jogged the axes around on the mill, I wanted to run a G-code program and make the three axes move around as they would when CNC machining a part. I'm not running the spindle in this simulation because it makes quite a bit of noise and I'd rather listen to the sounds of the stepper motors. I made up a widget of a part in Fusion 360. It's a simple rectangular block with a shallow hole in the middle and the corners rounded off. Once I finished the widget model in the design workspace, I moved over to the manufacturing workspace to create the G-code. After I ran the post-processor and created the G-code, I ran the simulator to see where the spindle toolpaths would go. The simulation shows the spindle moving around the part, but the reality is the spindle only moves up and down, and the part moves around under the spindle because it's affixed to the moving table. The operation starts by roughing out the part. Cuts are first made around the outer edges, and then a descending spiral called helical interpolation to rough out the hole in the middle of the block. Once the mill gets to the bottom of the hole, the helix expands to make the hole larger. Once the hole is roughed out, the program moves on to face off the top of the block. In between these operations, there are traveling moves where the cutter will move from one side of the part to the other. And finally, a finishing pass will be made where all the operations will be repeated with a shallower depth of cut.